Hello, so now we're going to continue to texture our model. Of course, we have done some progress since last time. And again, I didn't explain, I didn't explain step by step what I was doing. I just think that uh, it's kind of self-explanatory that I'm just overlaying some textures using base textures and just overlaying some of those to create uh, the textures for the model. And I'm going back to Maya to make sure that everything's according to to my plan and do something that makes sense and it's somewhat realistic of what the water tower should look like. Again, I'm just laying textures. So in this video, it's going to be just like the last one. I'm not going to guide you step by step. But as I said, it's pretty self-explanatory, the things I'm doing and just overlaying some textures. Uh, later in the video, there's going to be a part where I create the alpha channel for the ladder. Uh, so basically, I'm going to select an area and I'm going to work on the channels for that area and again um, you can ask questions if you need to and I'll answer as quickly as possible and again the only reason I'm not doing I'm not talking to through the whole uh, step by step process it's just because I actually recorded this video earlier and uh, I was actually doing some commentary on it but uh, I have some problems with the software and apparently the audio did not record so that's the only reason that there is no audio for these videos at least for the last one and this one but for the next one uh, that's actually fine I got all the audio for it so you should be able to follow the video step by step but again for this one and the last one I apologize but I, I had some problems technical difficulties with my software and that prevented me from recording the audio but again I'm doing this overlay audio now I'm just talking up over the video but I really don't have too much time to actually uh, guide you step by step so I apologize for that and but don't worry on the next the next videos came out fine and with all the audio and step by step instructions but again if you encounter any problems during this video uh, just comment, uh, leave your comments and questions. I'll answer as quickly as possible. Okay, so I'll leave you and watch the video. And that's pretty much it for now. In the next video, I'm going to show you how to create a normal map and a specular map.